Good afternoon world, I am Memoirs of a Gamer, my name is Nick and I'm about to sit and stream Tekken 6 on the PS3. The last few days I've been working my way through them. Uh, so far Tekken 4 is definitely my favourite, um, it's just so good. I've not played these games, I've only played the first three on the PS1. They were the first ones I ever played and then I kind of lost touch with gaming for about four or five years uh, through the PS2 era because I started going out clubbing because I was about 17. Uh, so yeah, I kind of miss those ones. I, I own all the tech in it. I'm one of those annoying people who buys everything and then never gets a chance to play it. So I've literally got a back catalogue that is just coming out my ears. So what I plan to do with this channel is sit and play these old games which I've never experienced before. So obviously I was born in the 80s. So I experienced the change of gaming as it happened, uh, going from like the 2D to the 3D. Uh, I've, and like I say, I played these old ones originally, but I've not played them as they've evolved. So it should be interesting to see how someone who's older sees these games, because it's so easy for old... You can play an old game, like say the first Resident Evil, not the remaster. I obviously have fond memories for that game, so when I play it, I am emotionally connected to it, so I still think it's amazing. But someone who's like my nephew's age, who's say 10 years old, he'll think it's absolute shite. So it should be interesting to see if my opinions have changed over, like, with the games over the years. Like I say, I loved Tech M4 and that was a PS2 game and that's still, I think that was, it, it was brilliant. I enjoyed every second of it, I got excited playing it. Not felt like that for, for a fighting game for a very long time. So, with that being said, let's go, start with Tech N6. I'm playing it on the 60 gig PS3, so if you can hear a fan in the background, it's probably what it is, because it always sounds like it's going to take off. I'm still getting used to talking on the mic. Um, I've never streamed. Uh, I've never streamed or anything like that before. So this is all new to me, sitting in a room talking to yourself. It's really, really strange. Uh, so yeah, bear with me. If you do like this video, please like and subscribe. I've posted six videos, seven videos so far, and I've not even got a single like. So like I say, it's trial and error. So hopefully, I will improve. Uh, I plan on doing some reviews in the future. Uh, talking about all sorts of things, so let's go. I'm probably gonna get my ass kicked as well. I don't even know how this plays out if it's a story or an arcade mode or in. I don't know. No, last night, because of the tech, when you play a fighting game, you don't really get much of a story. So last night, I actually sat and watched the Tekken story from a video on YouTube. Oh my god, it was, to be honest, it was ridiculous. <laughs> oh, this is what I wanted. Okay, arcade battle. So slow. Get ready for the next battle. Still a bird. Did I do that? If I remember correctly, Lars and Jin and Kazoo get yeah, ready for the next round. Brothers, I think. Oh, what oh, it's just it's confusing. Oh my god, these load times. <sighs> oh. Pandas are so cute.
Get ready for the next battle. I like the little tips on the bottom of the screen as well. I didn't know that in the last one. Ready. Get ready for the next battle. <sighs> These low times are seriously hindering the, the pacing of the game. It just shows you how far. <laughs> Look at you, love. <gasps> it just shows you how far we've come in the last. Well, how long is oh, this castle now? 15 years? Jesus. I still remember this coming out. PS3, I loved it. So good. <sighs> if Tekken was in the 80s, and we had 80s Arnie, he would definitely play Jack. You win. So Get ready for the next battle. I am ready. I'm just waiting for it to load. Get ready for the next battle. Oh, I always get my ass kicked on a rank match on any game. Oof, Chinda. <laughs> Come on! Oh. Oh. oh, look at the cute little pigs. You win. Get ready for the next battle. If it ever loads. What is this? What the? Extra round. I don't get it. <laughs> what am I supposed to just fight it? Oh, is this like test your might and smash your car into your fire? I don't even know what I was Get supposed to do the then. Battle. The battles don't last as long as the load time. It's so infuriating. Um, 
Oxygen. Another arcade battle. Final round. Fight. <laughs> So if I lose this, does this affect the story? Because it's an arcade battle. You oh. lose. Continue. Yeah, we better. Get ready for the next battle. An unusual name. Final round. Fight. <laughs> Oh, you bastard. Oh, my God. Lars. I don't like the way it keeps asking me if you want a character select as well. Can you change that in the options? A lot of characters, isn't there? Get ready for the next battle. All unlocked, I mean. Final round. Get ready for the next battle. Final round. Fight. Times are literally ruining the game. Get ready for the next battle. Final round. Fight. <laughs> Get ready for the next battle. Final round. Fight. <laughs> Get ready for the next battle.
Did I win? Oh. Gave not one then. <laughs> I like Lars's outfit actually. You know he's just so cool, don't they, in fighting games? Get ready for the next battle. What the f an Egyptian god? <laughs> what? Final round. Fight. What? How come it's I don't even know what's going on. Continue. I honestly do not even know what happened in that fight then. That was just like all over the show. What have they done to Tekken on this game? It's apps this game is awful. It's like the worst Tekken game I've ever played so far. It's, they've just literally like it just the loading times are absolutely horrendous. The gameplay is not the same. This, what, these battles aren't the same. It's just like, these bonus things. What the fuck have they done to it? Hopefully number seven gets rid of all this crap. It's that bad, I don't even want to finish it. What, what the fuck is that all about? Awful. Lars. Get ready for the next battle. Fuck off. Continue. Lars. Get ready for the next battle. I don't understand why he resets and it, it, that. He can save me if it works. Not even getting a cutscene after all that. Oh my god, that was that was horrendous. I just said that was the worst Tekken game I've ever played. I can't believe I can't believe how bad it was. It was like they tried to judge it up a bit and make it a bit more interesting and give you more gameplay and stuff to pad it out, but it was just shit. Proper shit. I'm gonna do a review about all these games anyway, just short and sweet ones, probably a couple of minutes each. But yeah. <sighs>
won't be playing that ever again anytime soon. Right, on to the next one. Please, if you could like and subscribe, we'd really appreciate it. Try and get at least some following. <laughs> so I'm not sat talking to myself in my bedroom. Right, thanks a lot. Bye.